Oh, hello! Uh, <laughs> you caught me. Um, I was just in the middle of picking up my base here, and uh, we we're getting ready to make some room for our new presence. It is dawn, so. Uh, <clears throat> oh, sorry, sorry. Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video. Chop, chop. And this time we are um, getting the 2019 Christmas gifts. Oh my goodness! Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it. But I gotta, I gotta build a thing for it. I was looking around at my base, and I'm like, oh my gosh, this is so messy. Look at this. We've got so much poop. <laughs> uh, it's not poop. It's gifts, and it's presents, and it's wood, and it's everything. But it's not organized at all. So. <clears throat> what I did is I started to build the, these two little bins and whatever happened to be there I just started building a bin around it and it the the two main things were um, these sleigh presents and the uh, firewood presents or not firewood uh, fire axe presents so came in here started uh, doing this some people joined some people left and stuff like that thank you for the money and for the power oh one two three Bob you're welcome did you get it uh, did you get it yet Smiley face? If not, we can always go run and get it for you real quick. Whoa! Hello! <laughs> he threw me on a sleigh. Thank you, buddy. <laughs> Code, where are you? I'm I'm uh, still putting away gifts. I shouldn't be. It is daytime. We gotta run. Let's do this. Um, first things first, let's head over to Fancy Furnishings and buy the presents that I wasn't able to buy yesterday because felt really horrible after that. I'm like, no, I didn't. Wait, is that mine? That is mine, isn't it? Oh, oh my goodness. Come here, you, you little lost soul. I saved you. You're welcome, fire present. Uh, here, go join your brothers. Boom, boom. And we're going to have to clear you guys out the way. Get you some room there. Hi, hi. Ooh, it's an amber axe. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I am definitely going to have to build up some more bins. <coughs> I offer last one. Uh, a gift for you. Merry Christmas. Thank you. <laughs> SKT, uh, SKT Danny. Hi, Bob. <laughs> What's going on, buddy? Okay, so they do have new presents in there, but I, I don't need to go get those yet because... Hi, Code. Hello. Hi. Hi, hi. Uh, I need to go get these over here. Um, so I'm going to pay for this, and then I'm going to pay him... Actually, I'm just going to pay him the one, because we're probably going to be over there for more than three minutes. It's a deal! <laughs> and totally... I am totally flexing right now with my pink truck, riding through, getting the Christmas presents. It's kind of like a kind of like a red sleigh in, in lumber. It's just the, you know, it's the... It's the mobile to have. I should have done that. I should have put a sleigh on the back so other other people could ride with me. That would be cool if there were like a, a four-seater. That way the entire server could go in in the thing. Four-seater sleigh. You could have two up in the, in the cab and then four people in the back. That would be awesome. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and open that up as well. Right here, the wobbly gift of uncertainty. I think that's what it is. Is that what it's called? Here, let's take a quick peek. Yeah, the wobbly gift of mostly teal. Wait, what? It was called low confidence the other day. <clears throat> Uh, species of daisies. The daisy gift. What is this? Craziness. Okay. What are you doing? Are you are you purchasing or what's going on here? I want to buy the daisy gift for seven thousand twenty. Yes. Uh oh. Hold on. There. That's mine. Dude, I can't tell whose present is whose. 
here. I'm gonna get that one. And then I'm gonna come over here. I'm gonna grab... Guys, come on! What are you doing? You know what? I'm just gonna start purchasing. I'm gonna purchase everything. You bring it over and I'm gonna purchase it. Do I want to buy the daisy gift? Yes. Thank you. Okay. Do another one. Do I want to buy the daisy gift? Yes. Thank you. Chat. Do I want to buy the daisy gift? Yes. Thank you. So I just purchased three daisy gifts. But there's only two there. Did, wait, did it charge me for them? <coughs> Excuse me. Did you not purchase that one? No, no, no. Get off of there. Get off of there. I don't want another daisy gift. Get, get. <laughs> there we go. Gift of mostly teal. Yes. Thank you. That one right there. Yes. Oops, did it fall off the counter? And I don't want to buy a daisy. No more daisies. No. No more daisies. Alright, so we bought this one. <clears throat> uh, one. Did we happen to purchase this one? Stop, people. Stop. <laughs> I can't tell who, like, what's what here. Are these pay, per, paid for? Did I pay for these? All right. All right, there's two. Is that one paid for? That one is paid for. And three. Okay, it was very confusing because, like... <laughs> Very confused. <laughs> admin. No, I'm not admin. I know default here though. Default TO TO though. <laughs> he is the owner. I am not the owner. <laughs> uh, not the owner. <laughs> I'm just really good at the game, that's all. All right, so we've, we've got those presents there. Come on, come on. Is Bob coming with me? Oh, they were all organized and now they're all not organized. Uh. Um. So we already have, oh gosh, dang it. We already have some predictions about what these things are, and we're pretty much thinking that these are the wobbly heads, the teals, and then these are going to be yellow ball. So um, whenever you, whenever Christmas Day, uh, um, four o'clock in the morning Central Time, it should open up the presents. That's normally what time the presents uh, are allowed to be opened. On the 25th, uh, you can open them up, but the uh, the ball will come with a serial number, and that serial number is going to be of low value to start. And just so you know, any ball with low value is extremely important. What is that? Dude, why did you pick it up? I can get it. I'm a big boy. Thank you. <laughs> hey, Bob. Hey, hey, hey unhealthy diets the gift of unhealthy diets now it looks like a hydro flask but at the same time it's got a cheeseburger logo so I'm wondering if it's gonna be a cheeseburger oh wait those are rips inside the the wrapping I wonder if it's a jar of cheeseburgers. Jar of cheeseburger. There's two. I'll get, I'll get a, a third one. Did, are, are you buying that? Are you buying it or what? Code, are you going to the art shop? Yes, I'm going to have to. All right, last one, last one. 390 for that. Here we go, here we go. Got it, good. 
Come on, buddy. I'm only buying three apiece. We want to buy three, that way we can have one, open one, and see what's in the last one. Oh, come on. Seriously? Come here, presence of you. Hold up. Why is that... Danny's? Dude, how did you do that? Okay. Well, uh, looks like I need to go buy another... Hold on. Are these all mine? The ownership is transferring funny. Alright. And... good... Go buy one of these. Now, I didn't see any other gifts or anything new in here. Any new Christmas lights? They look like the same from last year. Icicle lights. You can uh, decorate if you want. Dude, why would I want to buy a sink? I don't want to buy a sink. Unless you're buying a sink for yourself. Yes, please. Thank you. Thank you. There we go. Now that's three and three. Three and three. Good. Let's get it. <laughs> come on, Bob. Bob, come on. Bob! Let's go, Bob! Bob! What about Bob? There we go. Whee! Did you go pick up your... Oh, dude! Why would you do that? Just straight up cut me off. All right, looks like he's paying, so. Yay, that's, that'll work, that'll work. Let's go, let's go. <clears throat> the last place that we have to check is the land store. I don't think he sells anything, so. He specializes in land and real, real estate. Um, we need to go check Link's Logic and we need to go down to the paint shop because I was told that there should be one down there. And yes, we will have to wait for... Oh my goodness, really? Alright, hold on. Sorry, dude. Alright, there we go. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, kill. Cool, cool, cool. Fusion plays lumber? Yeah, Fusion plays lumber. I mean, that's how I signed his base. <laughs> Let's go! <clears throat> Hanging out around the world I've been dancing in a stray <clears throat> Okay. Let's back this up right here. We'll make sure that our 2019 gifts are ready for us to open. I need to build a tree to put these under. Uh, I will probably build them on a different base, maybe? Maybe. I don't know yet. Who knows? Uh, but for now, this is as good a place as any. By the way, yes, these are the presents that were um, given to me uh, on slot three. And I was not supposed to have them, but I totally did. Which was kind of cool. Hmm. I didn't hack them in. Somebody else did. And they gave them to me. I'm like, dude, I'm not supposed to have these. I'm going to get by <clears throat> But I didn't. It's cool. Now, if you happen to have the skull, that's, I think, still bannable. What's next? What's next? We go into the cave. <laughs> I should really just clean up the base before doing any of this. This is... Horrible. Horrible. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <coughs> <coughs> oh, excuse me. Oh. <clears throat> I was trying to do scat man. Skip. Diddle little dibble. Diddle little dibble. 
I'm the Scott man. I'm sorry. That is way too loud. I should probably stop maxing the, the microphone on that. Yay! Hoover! Perfect timing. Hoover, did you know I can't be over here? <laughs> Hoover. Okay. Um, let's see. When do you run next? We will depart as soon as everyone has purchased a ticket. Yay! Hi, I run this ferry. Yes. Uh, I'll buy a ticket, please. Thanks. We'll be on our way soon. Whee! Everyone purchase a ticket. Mm. Everyone buys a ticket. My game is broken. If it's broken, get off the boat. Sorry. Smiley faces. The temporary account? I wonder why it's called the temporary account. Did you do something earlier on a different one that you weren't supposed to? And that's why it's now your temporary account? Um, is it not leaving yet? Dude, why'd you jump in the water? Ooh, is it broken? Bob, did you buy a ticket? Oh, that's going to be so bad. He says yes. Is it broken? Here, let me... Let me back up. I'll see if it goes. Go, Hoover! Okay, it is a broken game. It's broken, broken. Poop. Alright, so we're gonna have to go to a different server. A different server. A server. A server. Let's, uh, let's go put my car back. <clears throat> as long as I park it really close, it should be fine, right? Um, would I be able to do this from a private server? It might take a second, but... <clears throat> Huge shout out to Sabrina Carpenter, aka Buzzing Gamer underscore YT, for having invited me into their private server. I'm going to use your private server to jump in and try and load and get to the, the boat before it breaks. <laughs> <clears throat> Come on, can I run? I can't run yet. Mm, no! Uh, to everybody that was inside the game with me, I do apologize about leaving so abruptly, but I need to get these things done, and my time is very short. That's the one thing I wish I had more of. A lot more time. You know? Um, I work. So I work eight-hour days. I work uh, Monday through Friday. Normal, like, outside YouTube job. I don't want to say normal because normality doesn't really exist in this world. Um, the job that I do, all right, I am an application development um, analyst. So I actually like create business applications for a, a company that I work for. Um, and not just that, if there's something that comes along, new technology, new something, I take that technology and I kind of manipulate it and fold it and, and do these things and then slap it into our own applications to kind of come up with these Awesome creations of our own. Oh, I hope I'm gonna have time. Please give me time, time, time. I don't know that I'm gonna have enough time. Hoover's gonna leave before I get there. And then I'm gonna have to wait 14 minutes, seven minutes on each side. It's gonna take forever. Ah, uh, poop. Come on, load game. Load, load, load. Please let my base load down the Hoover train. Ooh, ooh. <sighs> Have you ever had one of those days where you um, are like super energetic and super hyper? That is one of these days, definitely. Um, if you didn't join me in um, code time, 
So what I do every single day is I have a Discord. Discord.gg forward slash code prime eight. Discord.gg forward slash code prime eight. And if you go there, hang out um, every day just before I get home from work, I actually get on there, or I try to get on there, and um, talk to you guys directly. So you get a chance to speak with code directly. What? It's crazy. Um, a lot of people freak out. They're like, oh my god, I can talk to you. Yeah, you can talk to me. Um, it's like one of the one of the weird things that I do that normal YouTubers don't normally do or aren't supposed to do. I don't know what the case is, but talk to your fans. It's like one of the coolest things ever. Maybe I'm too accessible, and that's what makes me non-viable as being, oh, you're, you're famous. Well, I don't care. I really don't. I like hanging out with everyone. I like it when people freak out. <clears throat> I especially like when people like fanboy or fangirl. They're like, ah! Because <clears throat> it, it, like, I get excited. I'm like, oh, I got fans! So. But come in there. Hang out. Talk to me. Ask questions. Um, do you realize that I'm driving a car? So don't don't talk over each other. Don't make loud noises or distract me in some way. No, Hoover! Hoover, you get back here. Hoover. 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 <sighs> okay. Well, we're going to have to wait now. We're going to have to wait 14 minutes before I can actually do anything. So, that's poopy. You know what? We can do a base cleaning. Ooh, yes. <clears throat> okay, Google. Start a timer for 14 minutes. Sure, 14 minutes. You're not starting now. So it's actually two minutes of travel in between time and then the actual time of um, like waiting over there. So uh, I'm going to go back to what I was doing at the beginning of the video, which was just kind of cleaning this up. I will get over there uh, this video to um, make it happen, but check this out. We're going to have a, a base cleaning video and a... a uh, presence video all in one. Oh. So for those of you that love watching my base cleaning videos, you're welcome. They're fun. They are fun. Because when I do the base cleaning videos, it's more like a vlog than anything else. And it's very satisfying just to see me clean up things. I mean, look how, how much cleaner this looks now. Just from getting all this stuff out of the way. I mean, it was all over the place. Let's head over here. Drink. There we go. Oh, oh, come on. Out. Here, I'm going to move these presents over just a little bit. I'm probably not going to need that big of storage for the next section. Let's destroy that. Is that blue wood right there? That is blue wood. <coughs> Excuse me. I've had a little bit of a cough for the last couple days. Actually, just yesterday and today. There we go. There's that. Uh, we can close that door. Close that door. What's an alpha axe or a beta axe doing over here? Oh man. We're going to have to have, I think, only half of this for eyeballs and half for like alphas and betas. But I definitely want to make it this tall. So, all right. We'll keep going with this. Maybe I should get a truck. This could this could be a good idea. Here, let's uh, let's move these out of the way. Move them over here. Now I can take these and put them into the back of the truck, and then I can just drive the truck over. That way, I'm not wasting time. See, see, ideas. But that will also let me stand on the back of the truck to put them in, which will allow me to put them over the top of the wall. Sorry, kind of, kind of just talking myself through what I'm going to do. So I hope that's okay. People down in the comment section, yeah, that's fine. Cut. <laughs> uh, by the way, if you wanted to comment like seven or eight times, um, go for it. Sometimes I answer, sometimes I don't. Um, I do try and run through comments pretty fast. So if I misunderstand your question or comment, make sure you're you're giving me enough information to work with. So like if you just write, I like that code, I, what are you referencing to? 
What was a specific part? Did you like my hair? Was it? Did I laugh funny at a section of the thing? Give me some context to uh, to your comments. If you've already commented, you can go back and edit and say, "Oops, sorry," or whatever you want. If you want, you don't have to. It's your choice. And if you don't want to comment, you know, just hang out and have fun. There we go. Okay, this seems like a lot. Am I stuck on something? Oh my goodness, I am. I'm stuck on a scoob. Scoob. Woo. There we go. Get that present out of there. Nope. Hit that. Come on. Hit Scoo. that. Grab this. Oh, that didn't work. Okay. If I put the scoop under there, Scoo. hit that. There we go. <laughs> I got the candy cane out. Alright. It's kind of like a little hydro jack. Scoo. Woo. That's how you get stuff out from underneath the trucks. Uh oh. Oh, there's still one stuck on the front. Got it. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Just kind of pushing everything out of the way. That's awesome. Alright. Boom. A boom. Isn't that what effect says all the time? Boom! Boom! <laughs> Come on, come on, drop it in there. There you go. <laughs> oh, come on, come on. Nope, wrong way. There you go. Come on. Nope, wrong way. Ugh, really? No, don't kick over the other presents. Silly. <laughs> oh, man, come on. All right, uh, stop messing around, code. Ugh, that was rough. Not gonna lie. There, yay! Awesome. Okay, so now we can start stacking the second row. I'm just, I am so surprised at how many are here. I may have to make a second bin for the fire axes. That would be crazy. <clears throat> Came to Lumberland with a $20 bill. Bought an axe from Tom. In this game you can't kill. Unless using traps with chop saws, can't you see? I'm cleaning up my fire axes for you and me. See, just off the top of my head, next rap going on. That's the next song to drop. Find it on Spotify. iTunes Music. <laughs> oh, I've been asked a, a couple times in the past to like make a diss track on people. I'm like... Yeah, I would probably mess that up. I'm like, what do you mean? I'm like, I'm known for being the nice guy, you know? I'm the nice guy. Duh. Um, and it would not correlate. Co co it would not be in cohesion, co cohesion, cohesion. It wouldn't go with my channel. A, a diss track. Not unless it were something like, you're a really good content creator and I like your stuff. I. I liked and subscribed for 20 miles. See, and I'd be like, oh yeah, instructions were unclear. Is that what I was supposed to do to diss somebody? <coughs> Can you imagine if you were like mean about niceness? Like, that's a nice sweater! I like the way it looks on you! You pull it off! <laughs> You know, saying. <laughs> a lot of people forget that I was in the Marine Corps and that I was a correctional officer for nine years. 
and yeah. I think there's a reason I'm nice. is because I've seen a lot of bad. And I've been really mean in the past. And I can tell you from experience, things happen when you're nice. And I'm, I'm not talking about, oh, just nice for a second. No, I'm talking if you were nice 100% of the time to all people that you meet, and even when there's no one else around, that's when things happen. That's when good stuff happens. Doing the right thing for the right reason, even when nobody's watching. Um, we were at Sonic, and uh, we had just done grocery shopping with my dad, and we went over there to um, get him a chocolate shake, because that's what we usually do. We run him by and, and get a chocolate shake, or get some dinner, whatever words, like after we're done shopping. And he he got a shake. It was $2.88 <clears throat> with his senior citizen's discount. It's $2.49. So I gave the cashier a, a $2.54 which means there was a five cent difference. I should have gotten a nickel back, but instead he gave me a dime. I didn't realize it until after we had left and I started doing the math in my head. I'm like, dude, I got five cents more than I was supposed to. So I told him, yeah, we're, we're gonna go drop you off and then I'm gonna run back over there and give him back his five cents. He's like, what, for five cents? I'm like, yeah, I know. And in my head, I know Five cents to a corporation like Sonic doesn't make a bit of difference. There's not one reasonable thing inside my head that says you need to go back over there and give back the five cents. There's like, it's okay to not give back the five cents. Even Sonic themselves would look at me and go, dude, it was five cents. They would. They would say that. They would say, code, don't worry about the five cents, man. It was, it was our bad. Keep it. You know, and they would do that for me, but it still felt wrong in my head. And even my daughter was like, you're going to go all the way back over there for five cents. Yeah, I am. Even talking with my wife on the phone she's like, wait, you're going back over to Sonic? Why? To give back five cents. And I did. I drove back over there. I spoke to the guy through the drive through and I told him, um, you gave me five cents extra. He's like, it was five cents. <laughs> I'm like, I know. It just, here. <laughs> so I gave him a nickel back. <clears throat> so I don't, I don't know. It's, it's things like that. I've, I've been in moral obligations before, like moral dilemmas, but when is it too much? Can you ever be too nice or too honest about something? And I don't think so. I don't believe so. I think your honesty and your persistence to integrity is very important in this world. If you're a hacker, like an honest to God hacker, be proud to be a hacker. Don't try and hide it. Don't be like, oh, shh. no, come out and say it. I do this for this reason. If you're doing it for selfish reasons, be honest with yourself and be like, I'm doing this to cheat. I'm doing this to um, get ahead of someone else. There's, there's nothing wrong with being honest about that. <clears throat> and <laughs> anyone who knows me any exploiter who's ran into me, any person who's uh, done programming who's ran into me knows that I'm okay with that as long as you're honest with yourself. I mean, heck, even people that have uh, like doxed my account or doxed me, and trust me, I've been doxed before. <clears throat> I'm not too worried about it anymore. The people that usually do it, I talk to them and I speak to them like, 
do you really want to do this? Like, there, there's so much more stuff. I, I've become friends with multitudes of hackers and exploiters and people who aren't hackers and exploiters. Why am I lining this up? I don't need to line this up in the back of the, the car. Just get it in the back of the car, dude. And that's just it. I am friends with hackers and exploiters. Do I approve of what they do? No. I, I don't. I, I don't think there's a reason for it. But let's be honest. If duplicators and exploiters were not in the game, and if they didn't do what they do, would we have all of this stuff? No, we wouldn't. That's, that's an honest question. That's an honest answer. I'm not naive to say that all of these presents were bought legitimately. <laughs> oh my goodness, what is that? That is a different timer indeed. Hello, Hoover, are you back? Hoover, yay. All right. Tis time. Time for us to leave and travel back to where we came. Closing time. <coughs> Turn all of the lights on over every boy and every girl. I know who. I'm <coughs> sorry. <coughs> sorry. That was. Ooh. Code Primate Karaoke on Friday nights. By the way, we do have karaoke coming up on Friday. Uh, be there at 9.30 p.m. Central Time inside the Discord and uh, show up an hour beforehand or like we open up the um, the request line. I'll buy a ticket. Okay, we'll be on our way soon. <clears throat> Chat with the Hoover. When do you run next? Six minutes and five seconds. Okay, cool. Start a timer for five minutes. Okay, Google. Start a timer for five minutes. Why are you beeping at me? Okay, Google. Start a timer for five minutes. Uh-oh, I'm locked up. There we go. Okay, Google. Okay, Google. Google. Hey, Google. Googly Google. Google the Goog. How many people are watching on uh, on mobile right now and their phones are freaking out? Because I'm saying, hey, Google. Or, okay, Google. Here's one for you. Hey, Alexa. What time is it? <laughs> How many people's Alexas just went off? Boop, boop. Need to keep an eye on the time. Make sure that we're keeping up with it. Uh oh, I'm about to lose my hamburger jug. There we go. Kind of cleaning up a little bit. Looking nice. Looking slick. Again, uh, to the people that were inside the game with me, I do apologize for leaving. I always feel bad when I do it, but at the same time, I've got a lot of things to do. Like, I am still not done for the night. Even after I get this posted and up, I still got more things to do. And it's already, it's already 12 o'clock. It's midnight. I should be going to bed. Ugh. You know what? I can sleep when I retire. <laughs> Uh, by the way, if you happen to be retired already, how is it? Is it nice? Because, and, and also, do you have any tips for me for when I retire? What should I do when I retire? Because I, I never listen to advice. But then, 
I talk to my daughter and I'm like, you know what? Time's going to start flying for you. Time just flies whenever you get older. And she doesn't listen to me. So maybe I need to listen to somebody that's older than I am. Hmm? Maybe you could teach me something. Just saying. Uh-oh. By the way, there are special properties in the bed of the truck that uh, allow presents and wood and stuff to stick to them. I think I'm going to change the way my vehicles work. Because I want to make sure, like, once you step into a car, it's going to bind and model the stuff to the back. So even if it's like crazy unbalanced, it's not going to move as you start driving. Ooh, ooh, okay. Uh, it's been about three and a half minutes. Now let's head back over. I don't, I don't want to be late. I don't want to miss it. <clears throat> yeah, give me advice. Also, if you're in college, what major are you going for? Are you going for computer development or anything like that? What are you planning on uh, doing once you graduate college? All right, uh, when do we leave next? Three minutes. I was close, two and a half minutes, three minutes. So we still got some time. Okay, Google, start a timer for three minutes. Here, I'm not going to use my pink truck at all, but I will continue to unload the brown truck. Oh, come on, get up there. By the way, I didn't realize how much I love 80s movies. 80s and 90s movies. They're the best. Um, my daughter, she has never seen Hairspray. We watched the new one with, uh, who was it, John Travolta? It's not new. Hairs that Hairspray has probably been out since like I was back in the Marine Corps. Old school Hairspray. Or... Er, the new hairspray with John Travolta as the mom. Anyhow, that is a movie about race and segregation and hairspray and the 50s, 60s. It'd be the 50s. Anyhow, it was huge, huge time for um, segregation. And then tonight... And my daughter's so weird. She's like, I don't want to watch this. This is dumb. It's so stupid. And like 20 minutes into the movie, she's like, oh my gosh, this is like the best movie ever. Yeah, it's good. It's about very relevant issues of today's society and life. I promise. And how we got to where we are today. Uh, we watched 2-1-Foo. Thanks for everything. Um... For those of you who don't know who Patrick Swayze and Wesley Snipes are, <laughs> yeah. Anyhow, these are movies that I watched growing up with my mom, and there are they are movies that I thoroughly still enjoy today. They're awesome. Of course, I also like Bob Ross and uh, Mr. Rogers, so who knows. All right, let's get back over there. I do believe our three minutes is about up. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go now. Woo! When do you run? When do you run? Hi! <laughs> I run this ferry. When do you run next? One minute and 35 seconds. That'll work. Good timing. Good timing. Please remain squat bros. <laughs> 
squats, bro. <clears throat> squats. It's going to be a three minute travel time. So with a minute 30, that's going to be four minutes and 30 seconds from now. We're going to land. We're going to attack the cave. We're just going to go straight in. I'm going to show you how to get there. It's going to be four lefts. So it's left, left. No, it's left, 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 right, left, right. And then to get back, it's going to be left, right, left, right, 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 right. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, go check out the video where I show you how to get to the paint shop. It's not changed in years. I haven't seen anything new done in the cave at all. So, who knows? I don't know if he's going to change it up or, or, or change it to something different. <laughs> That'd be awesome if all the paths changed, but all the doors stayed in the same spot. So, <coughs> excuse me, I maxed out my microphone again. We've been recording for forty-six minutes. I apologize to anybody who like normally gets the thirty-minute sessions. Uh, I do not normally record for an hour, but it looks like that's going to be the case this time. Because I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to get these presents back over. Tell you what, once I get down there, show you what the price is, show you what the present looks like, stuff like that. I'll buy a couple for myself, but I'll end the video down there, and we can continue on. Okay? That way you can, you can get on with your day. Uh, if you're going to bed right now, feel free to like listen to the music in the background, listen to my voice as it slowly puts you into a slumber. I, I don't know. Whatever. Or if you're getting ready for school going to school in the morning or if you're getting ready for work in the morning if you're driving in the car you might not want to watch my videos if you're driving but I, I know how that is I'll, I'll put it off to the side and I'll listen to the commentary so I've, I've done that before you know I love audiobooks audiobooks are fun by the way Jason Siegel wrote a book called Otherworld it's on audio it's definitely not family friendly I would say 13 plus at least <laughs> Let's see. What else do we have here? Oh, it's a baby bunny! Oh! Oh! Bunny films. <laughs> it's, a, it's a baby bunny! He's, he's feeding a baby bunny! That's from Bunny Films, by the way. Bunny! By the way, Bunny Films, if you're watching this right now, I was told that we need to do another collaboration because there's somebody that's like a huge fan of both of us and we haven't done a collab in quite some time. So, reach out to me. Message me. Let's do this. Locus! Uh, I'm a flying Locus. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm a flying Midget, Cineac, Locus, all you guys. Creek? I don't know if Creek even plays Lumber. Miss Samantha, you guys want to come and play uh, some some Lumber Tycoon 2 with me? Feel free. Mm -hmm. Social Blade, who's this? I'm not following you. You're promoted... Excuse me. Okay. Okay. Sorry. Sorry. Are we? Are we here yet? Are we here? Yay! We've arrived. We're loose. There. We're loose, and we're off. Here we go. First things first. Head straight over to Link's Logic. We'll go see if uh, there's anything. Ooh. Whoa. My nose is completely clogged up. All right, Link. You do have a new item. Look, it's the tree of happiness for three billion. Can't buy that. I only get 20 million, Link. <laughs> You're so funny, Code. Oh, I know. 
So why do they call you um, Link if you have um, a uh, woodpecker on your head? I don't understand. I I would call you Robin, and then I could be Batman, Batman and Robin, <clears throat> or Gizmo. She could be called Gizmo, you know, like a like a logic thing. <laughs> Okay, so I know a lot of you kind of get lost down here sometimes. Um, this first little part, there are no curves. Not until you get to right here. All right, once you hit flat land, you have an option to go right or left. If you go right, the left path right here just goes in a big circle to the, the spot over there. To the right is how you actually get into like the cave and the, the north side of the maze. But we're not doing either of those. We want to get to the paint shop, okay? So check this out. When you first get down here to the... Whoa, 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 whoa. Just, when you get down here to the, the flat land and you need to go left or right, go left. All right, this is our first left. So left. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up. Back up. Back up. Back up. Okay, so we're going left. Left, left, and at this first split, we're going left. At this one, we're going right, and at this one right here, we're going to go left. Okay? So that was left, 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 right, left, right. No. Left, 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 right, left, right. Yes, that is correct. Okay. Oh, <gasps> dude. It's a fire presence. Look at that. All right, Timothy. Timothy. I would like to purchase this, Timothy. $80,000. Whew. Okay. Better be like a sleigh or something, or a sled. <laughs> the giraffe painting. By the way, that's Mamazing's painting. She did that. I love this song down here. Oh, ho, ho. buy this burnt gift for 80,060? Yes. Thank you, kind gentle person. You're welcome, Timothy. There we go. I'm going to buy one more. One more. Always get them in threes. Well, the, the, these you don't really need to. You just need the present and the gift. To uh, do kind kind of the thing. Oh, come on! There we go. Yes, please. <laughs> there we go. All right, I'm gonna call it a night. Thank you, everyone, for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos. It's your choice. If you want to, go for it. If not, that's cool, too. Love you guys very much. Have a great night, and we'll talk to you very soon. Outro.